What is up, SML? I am Primetime Triple Zero, joined by QP for SML Super Bowl 65. Jaguars, Eagles kicking off right now. Q, how's it going? It is going well, my friend. I am pumped up. This is the last one of the cycle. I know there's jokes made around that this one means a lot, but this one truly does mean a lot. You want to close out the cycle as the man, as the guy being talked about as we head into the next one. You have to to finish strong you get the last say you get to be the guy for the longest period of time the next sml champion will be what uh crowned in october so woods is going to start off with the ball handing it off and there's qp or, or kp excuse me stuff in the run but he falls forward yeah this is going to be a battle of uh i think actually it could be a battle of the offensive linemen if you have played kp which we both have this playoffs yes yes uh, the guy gets pressure he gets in there it's hard to run the ball consistently against him woods is going to need to run the ball well in order to stand a chance yeah it'll be an interesting game they say kp gets better as he plays owners uh he's starting off running the ball as woods and he loses a yard there there's a quick injury Quick third down and five. Uh, I experienced that. I just played, obviously, KP last week, and I had some third downs early. I was able to convert, but he made some good second-half adjustments, if you will, very Bill Belichick-esque. We'll see uh, how he kind of reads and calculates against Woods and makes adjustments as this game goes on. Yeah. Comes from the school of Dan. When you come from the school of Dan, you make adjustments throughout the game. Mid-game, first quarter, third quarter, fourth quarter. doesn't matter. doesn't matter. You make adjustments. Here we go. Woods, big third down to get some momentum going here. Um Josh Allen back to throw, looking pressure up the middle, and that's a sack, and that's a fumble. Oh, boy, he's picked up, so that's a field position saver, but we've talked about it time and time again. Big third down moments. KP always seems to find a way to get pressure. Yeah, he's truly, at this point, as far as active players go, he's probably the best at getting pressure on third downs. It's, it's almost every third down. You know it's a big moment. You know you need to oh, convert. Big return oh coming. Oh, gosh spinning nice spin oh fumble oh, oh and it's picked up by the jags wow oh my gosh one thing i noticed kp this cover two shell we're watching the instant replay here he always gets pressure off this cover two shell i don't know how it's like a weird looking cover two play where uh it's not exactly four straight guys in a row who do it there's a guy coming off the edge it almost looks like a blitz but it's not very very interesting stuff he's calculated he's calculated Hey, Trevor Lawrence starting the ball off right at midfield. I mean, this is just a perfect situation if you're a Jaguars fan. And he's going to hand it off up the middle. Big hole. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, my gosh. Uh, what's your prediction for this game? Um, I think that I put Jags 27-17 in the NFL props bet. Shout out to AJ. Uh, yeah, I think I put 27-17 to uh, Jags. They're going to win this. I think that AJ or KP is just a... He's on a roll right now, and we see how it goes. When you beat a couple legends, your confidence is at th through the roof. Yeah, no, I agree. Is is he's going to hand it off, a little counteraction, get stuffed there. The Eagles D-line has a chance to negate what KP mm -hmm. likes to do. Uh, going to be curious how KP, he does run him. He runs some stretches. He runs some tosses, so he won't just run it right up the middle. Uh, like single back trips here, KP likes a lot of trips play. He likes a dual slants uh, out of this play. Mm -hmm. He also likes a play where... There's a receiver who kind of shakes in or shakes out then in. So a lot of stuff he likes to single back trips. He is a big trips runner. I, I do notice that as well. Trevor back to throw. There's that dual slants play we just talked about, and he hits the backside slant. Uh, one thing he does enjoy, and you'll notice it a lot, especially on third downs, he'll have a crosser or a slant, and then he'll have a backside slant following just like that concept there. You'll see it all day today. Yeah, and he definitely likes to look at the HB angle routes as well on third down. Third and longs, he likes to have an angle route as a backup as well. Yes, that's true. Uh, he torched me on that a time or two. Um, under center, I form pro now. And he's going to go ahead and he's going to hand this off up the middle. Tries cutting back and doesn't get anything. Yeah, and I don't know if... Uh, I don't know what he saw there as far as the hole goes. I yeah. thought that he had you know, three yards at least on the left side and he just stuck with it. Yeah, it's going to be uh, – hey, watch the high-low on the bunch side. You'll see a corner and then a flat route maybe uh, if he is going to go uh, to a pass play here. Uh, time will tell, right? Uh, as he's back to throw, he's going to hand it. Oh, it's a play fake. Could have fooled me. Looking to throw is Trevor. He's going to step up, and he's going to get rocked. Him and Dan like that. They do like running up the middle, uh, especially in the goal line situations, but Trevor got eight up there. 
Yeah, that's. Uh, I wasn't expecting that play. That was different. That was different. And wrinkle here in the playoffs. Yeah. And again, uh, his mentor, Dan, I believe he did the same thing in his game. Uh, wanted to come out different with a few passes, few reads uh, in his first round game as well. Yeah. Um, How did that go? Yeah, well, not well. Not well. I'll say that. Third and goal from the 14. Man in motion now. Look at this. This is this is cerebral, Q. Back yeah. to throw. What's his user? He something. Oh, he throws and it's stuffed. Uh -oh. Well, hey, Woods kind of perseveres there. Yeah, and KP is not afraid to do the man, the manual motion. He doesn't do it and hike it as the guy's going. Nothing, you know, foul play, nothing like that. No foul play. But like you said, he's cerebral. He is very, very cerebral. cerebral. The guy, he's reading reads at the line of scrimmage. He's trying to identify the Mike Blitzer. He's trying to do all these things at the same time as putting his guys in position to succeed. I, uh, I skimmed through the commentary on the game I lost to him last night. And immediately what I noticed, the guy is making like defensive adjustments every play. I'm not, I'm yes. not sharp. I'm not sharp enough to do that. Are, no. Do you do that? I'm not either. No, I said it in the very beginning of the game before we even run our first plays. And I usually don't go back to it. Yeah. Uh, I, that's probably a, that's probably a downfall of mine because <laughs> a guy like KP, like you said, I was watching as well. That guy, he, every possession, he's said the depth at five yards, 25 yards, 15 yards. He, he's calculated. The guy's he's calculated. Just, yeah, I've never seen somebody do that. Like, that's crazy. Yeah. As he hands it off, Woods devotion. blown up. That's, by the way, Woods now, first down, both drives, starts off with a run. A little predictable so far. Yeah, I think he's I think he's feeling the weight of the moment. Yeah. Woods tends to, when he gets in a little bit into his head and he feels the moment, like you said, he gets very predictable. I think that in his worst games that he has throughout the season is when it's scripts are like this. It's yeah. very predictable running downs, passing downs, things like that. He was very free in the game I seen um, yes. against, I forget who I saw watch him beat. Oh, pressure up the middle again. Yes. Jukin getting a nice gain there. But again, we're going to talk about this all day. If KP is going to win this game, it's going to be because there's pressure up the middle. Check this out. KP on the user D line gets a swim move, gets pressure, Wood sees it and gets a good completion there to set up a third and manageable. But KP getting pressure up the middle is real. And here it is, third and four. Now, third and four is a little bit easier to get a quick read off and get that and keep the chains moving. It's third and six and longer when you play KP, where you know it's that pressure is coming within half a second. Is what's is what's the stream spinning for you? Yeah, it was okay. It's back for me. Yeah, a little blurry, but now it's back. Yeah, it's gonna. Let's see what Woods comes out in. He took some time picking his play there. Oh, what do you like think about this? this? Uh, I don't know. If I, I don't like, like this. If, he likes it though. He throws. Uh, oh, I just didn't like that. QP. No, it's you don't give yourself enough options. Yeah, if if that screen pass isn't there, that's your only option really on that play, and that's why I don't like it. You need to have at least one. To, I mean, at least two to three options. AJ in chat says can't count on blockers. I like that call. I like what he said there. Um, yeah. There was a fourth and well inches said. where KP had a stuff last game. I counted on the blockers. If I could have that back, I would. I'm sure if Woods could have that back, he would too. You just you, sometimes you just have to take matters in your own hands. Yeah, and KP's guys they tend to avoid the blocker. They yeah. just come in untouched. They're just so co you, they're coached like, well, motivated. Play, yeah, when you play exactly when you play KP, you know you can't rely. Watch on Watch the drags and the crossers here. Oh, he's gonna go ahead and oh, looking to throw. He's got a deep crosser. Is that PA flood? Yeah, yeah, he likes this one. Yeah, he likes that. Yep, he got me with it. He likes that. He likes the the deep cross, and if it's not there, he's got the high low outside. Very nice done. Man, what's the stream spinning a lot for me? I, mean, I don't know if it's just mine. Yeah, it is. As well, for mine. Going strong. He's mixing up his formations. So single back, I form strong. Just just a lot of just gritty formations. This is probably he can probably run right up the middle on this. He's going to. He's going to get two yards. Very hard earned. Yeah, Woods playing the run outside of that one pretty big run. He's playing the run pretty well right now. Um, you know, KP is a guy, though, He's yeah, he sure. hangs in there. He takes your best punches. He yeah, takes he your does. haymakers, your uppercuts, you know, your left hook, and he hangs in there. He spits the blood out, and he says, that's your best work. 
Because I'll you be know, here in the fourth quarter. When I when I lost to him, I felt like I was fighting Nate Diaz. Like I just punched him, and then he just like kind of <laughs> like just he, did, he just kind of grinned and he like flipped me off, and he kept walking forward. Yeah. I'm like, who is yeah. this guy? It was like when Triple yeah. G fought Canelo the first time. <laughs> Canelo lands a hook, and then he like his eyes open up because Triple G kept walking forward. That kind of moment. Yeah, that's KP. Strong jaw. Strong jaw. Under center now, single back ace. It appears for those at home. Um, Trevor, just make it look at this, making checks, cerebral. That's how you define KP back to throw looking. He's got the flat route to the right. Oh, he's kind of held on. I think he's looking at everything, but the flat route seen it late and that Eagles D line finally shows that they can get pressure too. Yeah. That flat route was open All at day. the, uh, yeah. Right. When he hiked it, uh, it might've been Woods's man, his assignment. What do you think this is out of a gun bunch? Um, some form of a trail or Half drag. Wheel, drag from the right. Concept. Yeah. There's a halfback There's wheel. wheel. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, he likes that. Yeah. He likes that play. Yeah, the entire right side had it had a drag and a slant coming across on the right, and then the wheel on the other side. So that he likes his wheel routes and he likes his crossers. Yeah. Man, what stream is spinning? I might, I might have to switch streams there, QP, if if uh, uh, if this continues. I don't know if it, this is happening for you too or not, but it's a little choppy. I have KPs ready to go just in case. We're gonna wash his hand off of the middle. Um, gain of one. He's playing the run well. Woods is playing the run well. He's not defending the pass, and that's the thing. KP, he'll, he surprises you. Uh, I saw a comparison to Andrew Luck. At, it, yes. I. I I don't want to comment on that one, but he hangs in there. It's like Trent Green for the Chiefs. Oh, jeez, with guy, Trent Green. He, <laughs> he uh, hangs in watch there. the corner. Q, <laughs> watch the corner, right tight end corner. Watch the seam from the other tight end. I'm telling you, watch out yeah, for this it. This is the Steeler. This Steeler drive. This Steeler. Yeah, drive. Steeler drive. Watch it. Yep, this is a dance. There it is. I'm a genius. He throws yep. right at it. Steeler drive. It's a dance staple. We're a genius. Oh, we're both so smart. Yep. Yeah, this is just it's got the it's got Dan's sticky, oily. I smell it. All I know he doesn't even yeah. wash his hands. Yeah. No, it, they're oily and they're all over the thing. The fingerprints are all over this. When game Dan right now, when Dan goes to the bathroom, he'll turn the faucet on to make it seem like he's washing his hands, but then he won't. <laughs> <laughs> hey, watch streaks. Watch streaks here. Tight end curl. It's that weird title. Watch the seam routes here. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's almost intercepted. Oh, double in. I, I run that play. I thought he was actually throwing to the right-hand side. I thought he was going to oh, throw to the right-hand side. He confused me there. That's my play. Hey, Woods it holding is. in here. That's stuff of a champion. I respect Woods and his old manness. I, I just got some... Yeah. What are these called? Cucumbers? Ranch. They're called ranch cucumbers. Um, they're like... They got some salt on them and like some sort of ranch sauce thing on them. Ranch are seasoning. Are they the actual fruit or are they dried? Oh, well, they're... The salt makes them crispy. Mm, interesting. Mm -hmm. I do enjoy cucumbers. Oh, I like a good cucumber salt as well. Hey, what do you think about this game so far? I think that Woods is doing exactly what Woods needs to do. If he's not going to be sharp on offense right now, at least play some strong, good defense, and that's what he's doing. That's one thing about Woods. He hangs around also. They fight differently. They hang around differently. More of a George Foreman style. Takes the punches oh. right to the head. But has some power behind the punch. Look out, Woods. Oh, no. Oh, man. You know, I hate to see it. I'll, I'll do this, too, when I'm anxious and nervous. You notice Woods just kind of immediately started drifting to the left there. A replay. Okay, there it is. Watch, yeah. he takes a snap. No real pressure. Mm -hmm. Just kind of drifting. I, I'm sensing a bit of uh, anxiousness from Woods right now. And that gets me a little nervous. Not as decisive. Yeah, he needs to just get a couple easy completions. The problem is he's only looking for the drag route right now, I think, and KP's all over it. There. Well, stretch run. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. Oh, man. Oh, man. Falling forward. What happened there? Like a pinball. <laughs> what is that? What? Look at them physics, man. That was weird. That's, uh, I mean, his last name is Strong, and he represented that last name well right there with that run. Maybe that gives Woods the confidence he needs. He didn't need a first down. It was That was desperation right there. We need to see him move the ball past the 50-yard line 
and at least get into field goal range. Under center. Look at this. He's, he's sticking with the run game, Q. Mm -hmm. and, and you have to when you play KP. Yeah, you have to. I just wish he would be a little more creative. I mean, it's okay to run a shotgun every so often. You're just kind of lining up under center and plunging him right now. Yeah. I would have liked a play action or a shotgun, like maybe a read option out of the shotgun on that last mm -hmm. run. He just picked up a big first down off of a under center run. That next one could have been a play action or a read option. I think it, mm -hmm. either or could have been mm -hmm. a good choice. Or is this you got to keep a guy like KP on his toes. Uh, and I thought this was Atlanta. New York Giants Stadium. I don't know. It's a, well, It looks like an ugly stadium. Hand oh, off. Oh, oh, oh. Juke oh and Mooka now breaking another tackle. What? I thought that was like going nowhere. Yeah, these. I, I said good run because I thought he got four yards out of a play where it looked like he was getting nothing. And then it turned into another first down. What's going to take the lead this drive? If his running back runs the ball like this, I, I mean, you got to keep feeding him. Stay tuned after this game. We will have post game interviews unless if a guy decides not to show up. We've had that happen twice. Play fake. He's got the flat route. He hits some woods now. A little more, a little more decisive there. I know it's just a flat route, Q, but I like that a lot better. Only three passes yeah, today, by the way. I like it a lot for a lot of reasons, uh, but one of the main reasons it's a quick dump off, and it's not a drag route. It's a quick dump off to the outside, so it keeps KP on us. Now you got a hard flat, maybe a little bit more. You can't cover that inside middle five yard area a little bit better. So this is more wood style right here, running it, mixing in with some passes. Let's see what he does here. Under center. Looking to throw. Oh, get rid of it. Oh, I feel like he could throw that a little bit sooner, but takes yep. a hit. Incomplete. I agree. I think he saw his running back get caught up on the line and looked away from the running back. I would have just kept my eyes on it and just dumped it off. Quick three yards at the least. So it's been an eventful cycle. A lot of fun games, a lot of surprise champions, only one repeat champion. The cycle of parody, which uh, some say are, which some say is good for the league. Some like it. Others like me hate it. Yeah, me too. Back to throw. Nice. See, that was decisive. That Great was throw. as good of a throw as Woods has had all day. Yep. That was. Is that that uh, receiver, Kent? Yep, that's Kent. So Kent is his go-to guy. Uh, again, shout out to AJ. If you saw him in the prop bed, uh, he was in AJ's prop bed. Will Kent score a touchdown in the first half, I think? What'd you put? I said no. I forget what I put. I'm I nervous. Woods' is hiney is just a little too clenched. He's not yeah. going to be thrown near the goal line. Because yeah. you don't need to. Oh, in the end zone. Touch down, Eagles. And Woods is an extra point away. From taking the lead somehow in the Super Bowl. He just hangs around. That was a great drive. Let me just say, very bad. That's a championship level drive right there. He kept the passes downfield, quick pass, short pass, long pass, well run. A lot of good runs. Just, we got ourselves a game now, Prime. Yeah, we do. And I went ahead and refreshed that and then jumped us way ahead. Um, kickoff up in the air, fair catch is caught about nine yards deep. We've got a good game on our hands, QP, and that brings me to the prime percentages. KP has a 55% chance of victory despite trailing. Here's why. He has a ball. He can go two for one. He gets a ball at halftime. I just think KP still right now has the bigger odds of victory. Yeah. No, he just did a chuckle after that touchdown and said, that's your best shot. Yeah, that's funny. Watch this. Oh, that's a, that was a floater and it's complete. <laughs> I can't believe he completed that. I think what I hate even more is that the guy that was running beeline down there didn't even make contact with yeah. him. At least mm -hmm. blow him up and force an incompletion right there. Yeah. In real football, that guy's helmet would have popped off. Yeah. Well, back in the old days when you could hit people. We call those the glory days. Yep. These kids that are under 24 don't even know what that means. Under 26, probably. Empty. X trip. Interesting formation there. I see we got Polly, DW, Spokey, Double Rice, No Bean. Watch. A lot of good cats in here. Could it be a cross here and a slant from the left? Uh, the drag. It's going to be a drag a with a post. I was yeah, thinking 84. 
he's hot routing now, so I don't know what it is. I think 84 and I deep think cross. I think 84 is the cross, yeah. Yeah, we're just all over 84. Dude, we're just on it, man. Yep. Yeah, that sounds like two guys that regret losing to a guy that we feel we should have beat. Dude, I hate to say it, so I'm not going to, but you read my mind. Yes, hey, you know what, though? watching and not playing, it feels different. It feels different. It's 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 easier back there, though. The thing about this guy is when you watch it, I imagine it's like watching Dan or watching me, though. Like, you watch it, and it's just simple, but then it's just kind of hard to stop. Yeah. Yes, he, KP is one of those guys. Very good. I mean, well, one, it's hard to move the ball on him. Let's call it what it is. He's a great defender. Yeah. Great defender and effective offense. Doesn't make a lot of yeah. mistakes. Doesn't make a lot of errant throws. Yeah. Dare I say, you're not going to like this one. He's almost out matting Matt these days. I respect Matt. You don't got to bring Matt into everything. <laughs> <laughs> Single back trips. You know what this could be? If it's not a run, I'm telling you that shake, it's like a long route where it's a shake corner in. It's kind of hard to explain. There it is. There it is. Do you see that? Mm -hmm. Yep. He, he gets he completes that about once every 10 times but when he completes it he feels good <laughs> yeah you're so all keep... over his play calls this game it's it's, it's quite impressive yeah I'm not gonna lie don't remind me i've i've known him every time i just botched a fourth of inches i'm not salty though untouched untouched oh. tight slots halfback week interesting formation interesting probably slot corner no, this is that quick. Yeah, this is a quick uh, wheel routes. Yep. yep there the it wheel is. Routes. Oh, he's, and he hits it. Oh my I told Woods about that. Oh, man. What a throw. He loves the wheel routes to the right side specifically. Yep. He got me on that play, actually. This Four That verts. play he got me on. Mm -hmm. Look at that. And he, he's really good at throwing it right when it gets past the cloud. I actually thought Woods' this guy was going to intercept that. It looked like it was a lower pass yeah. than it was. And and that's a beautiful completion. I mean, what was that? A 40 yard yeah. throw out of the sack. Yeah, that was a nice throw by Trevor. This is like Trevor Lawrence, what everyone thought he would be in, in the uh, real NFL. Then what that does though, that sets up a field goal and you can get a two for one here. So uh, nicely done. <coughs> that was very good. Yeah, patience. That, uh, yeah, that pivot route is uh, another Dan in his favorite. They yeah. like to throw that pivot route on the right side. Yeah, pivots are nice. Gun tight. Dan used to run the corner and then the deep. Yep, there it is. I was going to say, Dan run this exact same play. He'll, he'd usually hit that or he'd hit that flat to the halfback on the opposite side, drive corner. Yeah, and this is a. Uh, I feel like KP's I'm watching putting Dan. putting together a good drive. Yeah, this, the, like I said. His oily hands are all over Listen, the script right this now. This is not this isn't Dan from the cycle though. This is Dan Madden 21. Yeah. This is like peak Dan. Back, back when you respected his offense. Back when back when I like he could score 30 on you. Anyway, out of if the gun. Put together a good drive. Is man, I'm still waiting for that seam play where the tight end kind of sits on a curl. There it is. This is the exact play. Uh, and he just bottles it up. What's going to take a timeout here? I would. That's that scene play where the tight end sits on a curl. Yeah. No, go for the block. Timeout, I would. I'd go for the block. It's a Super it. Bowl. Good kick. Good contact. Clean ball. I need some chocolate milk. Woods is bending but not breaking. Again, he is. He, three field goals. He tightens up. Yeah, he tightens up once he gets to about the 40-yard line. Yeah. Is this game playing how you thought it would? Um, yes and no. I thought that Woods would maybe have field goals as well. Woods is, over, I think, one for three or one for four on offense, and KP is three for three, but all field goals. So I think that I the <laughs> score is about what it would be, but I thought it would be maybe nine to six, no touchdowns. How much How much stock do you put in this drive? Do you think this is a big drive or no? Uh, no. I even the two I don't for even one could get the ball. Who gets the ball? Yeah, KP, the ball? that's what I'm saying. KP does. Ooh, it could be. It could be a big drive. Pretty big drive. If Woods can get three, it's huge. You know what because else is huge? Tiny's head is huge. <laughs> the biggest head in the league. Biggest head in the world. Chiropractor to adjust his neck so it can wobble right. So it can function and twist and turn. I'm retiring this meme at the end of this season. So 
I just want to say for the last time, last time ever, Tiny's head is huge. Yeah, that's a noggin. That's a noggin on you, boy. Jeez. Oh, no, it's it's a handsome noggin. Rocked. Anyway, I just wanted, this is the last time. I told Tiny I would stop showing that, but it's the last game of the season. I hope he understands. Um, I'm never going to bring it up again. I mean, we all saw it. We all saw his, uh, <laughs> his, his angry outburst over it. Here we it's go. All in love, Tiny. Josh Allen, back to throw. Oh, God, look at this. This is what I'm saying. This is oh. what I'm saying, QP. What down is it? What situation is it? Mm -hmm. Second down. Look at this. Only rushing four. Yep. Well, let's look. She has to replay here. It's a passing down. Let's watch this pressure get through here. He takes the snap. One, two, three guys all get the shed. Mm -hmm. Impressive. And look at how, look, that was just, it's, it's in one second. His guy literally yeah. swim moves in one second. Impressive. When you need it most. When you need it most. Third and 10. Woods back to throw. Looking, looking. Pressure again. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. This is, I'm having PTSD from my final drive where I'm at the 15 yard line thinking I got a good look into the end zone. And his guys just are hitting me after half of a second. The truth says maybe a quick line adjustment would help. Maybe the truth knows what KP is doing for some reason. Interesting. <sighs> CML guys, they just know the game a little bit more than they us. They just know the game. Idiots. They we're just, ignorant. We're Idiots. Just... He says, just slide the line to the right. He says, that's all you got to do is just slide the line to the right. We're the type of league that shoots basketballs in the milk crates. Yep. Out of the farm. Yep. We're not doing, we're <laughs> not in a glorious basketball. Gym. Basketball with no net. No net. It's no net. Crooked. Yeah, we're shooting it's with nets. We're tilted shooting down. with a... Yes. A ball of yarn is what we're ball shooting. Ball of yarn. Not even basketball. It's the side of the barn. You dribble in dirt. Because dad didn't CML's have money to pour concrete. Glorious stadium gyms. Look at that. Another, another. Oh, oh my gosh. God. What a that throw. A wheel, route? wheel route. That's a wheel route. Yep. He likes the wheel routes. Did anybody tell you? Uh, I was told. And guess what? It didn't matter. He knows when to hit them. Knows when to call them. This is now huge. This is tough. This is not what you wanted for Woods. That was a three for one. You know, I see, by the way, Stavo and Chat, Spooky, Fig, FaZe, which I think is old Woods' son, actually. DW. Shout out everybody in chat. I did play the truth one time, and I absolutely whipped his butt. And Spooky, I played one time. Absolutely trashed him. Just completely dominated the both of them. Felt pretty good. Just completely. You are the guy we trot out. When these guys get to yapping, we trot out our champion. We just, I mean, it wasn't even close. I think, uh, I think, I think uh, it was just a utter domination. Hey, Woods needs to hold a three here to keep it a one score game. Yeah, that's what's kind of crazy about this is it feels like KP is just on offense every time, except for uh, maybe a few. But it's only a five point game. Woods can actually literally take the <laughs> take the lead here with a drive. Well, not here, but if he gets a stop. Yeah, I know. I predict a punt. I predict a punt on the first drive. This is big stuff. Should I put my Tony Romo hat back on? Yes. Okay. Let's see. Let me rub my crystal ball and see what formation he's out in. Mm. Prime percentages though, right now, by the way, 65% chance KP victory. 65% chance. Yeah, I could see that. Watch the, the crossers here, the tight end drag, and then 82 coming across on another drag. He does like he it out of this formation. Drags. He loves the drags out of the single back. That's oh, not his corner. Nope, yeah, it is. I'm a genius. Oh! Yeah, it was a crossers. We know what we're doing out here in Indy. We just couldn't win. Shame. It happens. It's painful. That's all I can say about that one. It's painful. I feel like I've been stung by a bee and then a hornet at the same time. It only feels you for a Madden 25. Probably a halfback angle here. What do you think? In a corner? Play, yeah, halfback angle for sure. There's a halfback angle. There's a corner. 
He's got him. Oh it's complete. Gosh. Running yeah. down the sideline. Can he get caught? If not, it's going to be a two-score game, and he does get caught, but not till he's inside the 15-yard line. Yeah, I'm convinced he throws a halfback angle in every third down. Uh, after watching your guys' game when he did it uh, on every third down on that one drive, and then now here, I'm convinced. Third downs, you got it. It's the halfback angles coming. Um, that's a good point. Throw it, though. Let's see what he does here. I think a run inside. He's going to go ahead. He's going to hand it off. Stuffed inside. Loss of one. Yeah. And again, uh, for the hundredth time, Woods is playing really good. Inside the defense. Yeah, inside the playing good 40. defense. It, yeah. Play, playing good inside the 40. Um, but his run defense has been good all game long. Yeah. He needs to tighten up on the pass. We he need to see an interception. These Eagles, these Eagles need to do something in the secondary. Yeah. I would. I think. I think he needs to be careful, hard flatting here. Um, some people do enjoy corner routes. I don't think he runs it too much out of the wing slot formation, though. Um, as he, there's one right there, throws Woods is there on a user, nicely done by Woods, holding him. And he falls forward for gain of five, but big third down. QP. What, what kind of defense are you playing here? Well, I suck at defense, so he probably would score on me on third down. But I would probably in the red zone. Uh, a guy like Dan told me cover four palms in the red zone is actually pretty good. He wa needs to watch the quarterback run up the middle. Woods needs to watch that. Throws. Oh, he's got him. Okay. Touchdown. Jags. They take a two-score lead in the Super Bowl. That was kind of like a realistic animation almost where he kind of hits the running back on the hip and he catches it. Yeah, wasn't the most uh, accurate throw, but I mean, the guy's got eyes everywhere. That's a huge play. We'll watch the instant replay here is was it surely gonna take the knee? Look at this play. Roll starts rolling out. Just kind of hits him in the back pocket there. I think KP, yeah, the prime percentages have come back now. 98% chance of victory for the Jaguars. I just don't see KP losing this game. Yeah, I don't either. Um He was a favorite going Woods, in. But yeah, he was. I think so. I just don't think Woods is – he doesn't have the style also to make a comeback. His offense is not a, you know, very explosive. He needs to have, like, one of those crazy break-off broken tackle runs <laughs> for 70 yards here. I think Woods kind of – oh, hold on. Big run coming. He needs it. Nice run. I I watched Woods a little bit, this playoff run, and he was a little more down the field passer. I know KP's got a good defense, but I feel like he's been a lot more under center just, just check down Charlie this game, and that will happen from time to time. But I just I feel like Woods needs to just be a little more confident throwing the ball if he's gonna come back. Yeah. Well KP's defense is really good. Pass defense good. ten yards and under. Ten yards and under. He's good. Like you said, he needs to find the out he needs to find the deeper routes. Or just run the ball. I mean, he's running. It's still only a two score game. And there's still a quarter and a half to go. I feel like the first half went by way faster than this one quarter for some reason. Yeah, um, could be a lot of incompletions. Last Woods time. needs to keep the drive alive, though. QP, I got a question for you. You're a smart guy. You 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 are uh, you kind of a Madden savant. Um, I have the schedule for Madden 25. Our off season, our kickoff schedule, Hall of Fame announcement schedule, top player release schedule. I've got it all. Should I start leaking dates on this stream? Mm. Or in chat afterward, or should I give it a day? In the chat afterward. Okay. Oh, picked oh. off. Maybe we should start leaking it. Oh, jeez. Oh. Just knows the game. The guy just is freaking world class. What else can you say? That was a top tier user. Oh crap! I pushed the instant replay button too late. And KP is what? Is he going to pull starters? Could you imagine that? The last game of the season. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine? He just starts benching everybody. Woods, don't do. Don't bench Josh Allen. Who's Who pressed start? Who pushed start? We're watching Woods, right? Yeah, okay. What's Woods he looking at? <laughs> What's Woods looking, he's looking at? at? Don't bench Josh believe... Allen, Woods. Don't do it. <laughs> no, he, he isn't. He's look, He can't believe these receivers are doing this to him. What is he looking at? Is he looking at third down running back? He's oh, like, 
for a deep ball. He's looking he, for a deep ball. He's just, he's in disbelief. He's in a friendly quit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he can't believe what is happening. Uh, and I can't either. KP is just running the gauntlet. KP is doing a good job. I'm proud of him. He's different. CML guys are different. He's he's just he's really balanced as a player. And I'm proud of him for that. Look at this. Nicely done. Matt says KP possibly cheated. Now that's a that's an interesting spin. Yeah, uh, I didn't look at the comments after he said uh, something dumb regarding me. What did Matt say dumb about you? He's an idiot. That's all you need to know. <laughs> Let me find it. I can't find it. I'm just, I'm just a guy that loads up and plays. I don't have good predictions. Yeah. He said my predictions are ass. Well. Hey, I predicted Woods was going to get a stop. I didn't know CML was going to bring out everything they know on offense today. Who is CML? Oh shit! Oh, you broke something. Uh, Did you just that drop was something? my controller. Yeah, that's my PS5 controller. That sounded like uh, glass breaking. That's a controller on tile. Oh jeez, <laughs> that's not good. What did you ask me? Well, Before who was that, CML? Your last six call-ups. How about that, buddy? Oh, that's a league. Okay. I didn't know they still existed. Um, Woods needs a pick six or something here. Yeah, he needs something. He needs a fumble or like one of those NCAA blunders where the ball flies back 50 yards behind them. Something weird. Um, yeah, he needs, <laughs> he needs something. Third and two, he's going to go ahead and hand it off. Woods jumps the gap and he falls oh. forward. That's Madden 24. I hope that gets taken away. A lot of guys fall backwards. A lot of, I mean, it's, it's you know, I hope that gets taken away. Or like, use some logic. Derrick Henry, Nick Chubb, big physical back, probably going to fall forward in a one-on-one. -on -one. Let's see here. He's, he's down by 12. If he can hold the field goal, it's still a two-score game. I always know when Prime is DMing or reading a message because he can't do both multitask. Oh, you're you saying say. you're saying you like when you say something, I completely ignore what you just said. I can tell when, yeah, I can tell when you're uh, reading you're, or you're, responding. You're so smart. You know, you know so much. Thanks, man. All these meetups. Here you go. Hand off. Oh, play fake. Could have fooled me. He got the running back. He throws it to him. Inside the 15 yard line. You know, this 35, Tajay Spears is the runner, and this 35, I mean, he's uh, one of the prime receivers out here. I feel like I see his name a lot today, or his number a lot. He's caught a few wheel routes, caught that one right there. Here we go. He's going to hand it off. Man, this is just, I just, I just want to see something exciting right now. This is the last Super Bowl of the cycle. We just need some pizzazz. Ah, I hate to be a Debbie Downer. I think it's just Don't. the wrong crowd, the wrong two opponents to get that pizzazz. We need, we need. You remember that last year playoff game between the Chargers and Colts? How legendary that game was. Felt like a Super Bowl. Dude, that was a good game. Two oh! years ago. Two years ago. Which one was it? Two seasons ago. Oh, the AFC Champ. No, that was a divisional. Was it? No, it was a divisional round. It was, it was divisional. It was divisional. That felt was, like a Super Bowl, though. Felt like a Super Bowl. We both know. We both knew and. I mean, I didn't win a Super Bowl, so again, matter, dude, but... <laughs> it's like, how does it happen? Yeah, hey, let's okay. put all put our all into our game. You know, Sad. parody. I think I feel like Madden Twenty Four has been the just game of parody. Not a bad thing. Again, we talked about it earlier, but um, I think it's good for the morale of of many people. I agree. I think that it's definitely makes the league as a whole um, more competitive and better. I think maybe it, it could be in my own mind as a guy that used to feel better than I am now. Uh, oh, it's a razzle-dazzle. Oh Hold on, Q. Yeah, Touch. Yeah. <laughs> Don't be short. Nope. 
Yeah, he likes that triple option too. He hit me with that. I think you do too. It must be an AFC South thing. I do like the triple option. I usually only do it when cool. I'm cocky when I'm up two or three scores though. Kind of like how KP. That's KP is right, right now. now. Exactly. <laughs> you guys are just champions. Watch the, if he get bust out the Philly special here inside the five. He might just do that. He did against Stavo. Nice defense. If he can get stopped. I just still don't think it uh, will matter. His defense is stopping Woods every time. Woods can't even throw a complete a pass. He can't even get time to stand there in the pocket and wait for a route to open up. No. He can't. He's going to hand it off and get stopped again. Uh, dude, we... Uh, I mean, if Boyd's going to hold him to three here, hypothetically, get a touchdown quick and get a stop, all of a sudden. We still have a game, as crazy as it sounds. It, it, let's see what he comes out in. He's ready to use his read triple option. I form pro. I think he's just going to run it. Watch the tight end screen, maybe? No, it's a run. Right up the middle, and he's into the end zone. I feel like Woods wasn't ready for, like, the halfback dive there. I just call it cover four, but eh. Yeah, one thing I noticed about KP is if he's about six and in, he's going to run the ball almost every single time, all three downs. He's not afraid to live with the results of whatever he gets out of it. 12-play drive, dude. I was literally about to say that. 12-play, 49 yards. That was as like... As it can get. It's as bad as it can get, if you're now, Woods. Now, Woods played in the Super Bowl a couple seasons ago and got yep. smacked by dump. Do you remember that game? I didn't watch it. Uh, I, you know, for personal reasons, I don't watch certain guys. Somehow Woods, don't, Woods has picked, they said the Woods Chiefs, is, don't, just because I said that. Woods has picked the, picked top five like three times this cycle and he's been in the Super Bowl three times or something, right? I mean, it's wild. How is that even possible? Yeah, he has one of the more unique, I mean, I think that Eli Manning comp that somebody said was as spot on as it can be for a cycle <laughs> player because he had a lot of lackluster seasons, but those times that he put it on, he put it on. He went all the way to the Super Bowl, whether he won or lost. I mean, this is his third appearance. I mean, that's most appearances, I think. I believe he has the most Super Bowl appearances of the cycle, which is kind of crazy. Yeah. Um, well, actually, are you right? Yeah. That's wild. If is he the third best of the cycle then? Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. That's picked off. Probably not a good time to ask that question. Again, yeah, he's a hard guy to judge this cycle. Definitely a hard guy to judge. It's like Gutta. Gutta's going to be a hard guy to judge as you get closer to that 7 through 10 best player of the cycle because he has a Super Bowl, and he beat set feet lead every game to win it, uh, win the Super Bowl, I believe. Uh, but he only had two playoff appearances or three playoff appearances, maybe if that. Who's your top five? Go. I got dump at one. And I, I don't. I won't have an order, but I'll go dump at one also. That's my only order. Yep. Uh, I have you. Ah, eh, let me bring that back because you actually you lost. Let me put in guys that I know for sure. Dan. Okay. Just two. You know, I think that uh, I do believe Woods is going to be. I mean, he's been to three Super Bowls. It's hard to deny that. I don't know though. It's hard. But for what? arrogant purposes, I'll put Dump, Dan, QP, Prime, Doink. I think I might have Woods over Doink. I only yeah. can't say that because Doink beat me in the Super Bowl. So if I play that card, he could just be like, I beat you in the head to head Super Bowl matchup that we played each other in. And so that would put me over you. Listen, all I know is I'm the number one. <laughs> and I do see truth saying Dan is still top five. Yeah, the buddy is top five. Dude. He's got like second most cycle wins or third most cycle wins. He's got act of active players. What is Polly saying? Dan's not the best player in this in his house. Can't be. What is Polly saying? Come on, QP. Oh, he should not be. Who? Who shouldn't be? I I, Polly's got it against Woods, it man. Polly's got it against Woods. Yeah, I don't know. If I, I I don't pay attention much to the NFC. I hate to say it. I forgot they even had playoff games. 
Um, yeah, AFC is always wins. Yeah, it, well, and they talk. We got a lot of chirpers in the AFC. I mean, we're all the talkers mm-hmm. on that side. Um, we sell. You know. I mean, we sell the tickets. Yeah, Pay we put view. asses in Floyd seats. Mayweather. I mean, at the end of the day, Dan these, not top five. What? At the end of the day, these perfect. CML guys are watching us. You know what I mean? Like they're watching, they're watching. Oh, us. every, every, yeah, every Super every Bowl game. I see. We're not watching three their or four bowl of them. or whatever they call it. Um, cute. Oh, Polly going with the old cheap shot. I already acknowledged it. Polly, are you listening, buddy? Or are you taking too long to get your messages out? I already acknowledged Doink beating me in the Super Bowl. That would be the NFC, buddy. We love Doink. I respect Doink, I respect actually. Doink. I do that was too. weird. I respect Doink. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Doink's a good guy, actually. Although he kind of set me up. I wish he would have told me he was going to bench his starters in that game instead of playing it off like he was going to play hard. And then he, then I come out and what is quarter, what's his quarterback's name? Ritter. He's not even in the game. Yeah. But that's okay. This truth is on the Sim Madden League for the fourth cycle in a row, commenting he's actually here watching. Sp- <laughs> yeah. And just somehow every time he's watching. And I'm going to regret this because I actually play uh, this fella in NCAA and he's Florida and he beats everybody like 45 to 10. Oh, really? These CML, yeah, these CML guys, they know things, you know, very, that other guys talented. don't. They're very talented. Yeah, they're very talented. Very talented players. Very talented players. Oh, Woods. Oh, look at this throw. Is nice there throw. a miracle in Atlanta? Is this the running back Henry running down the side? Touchdown, Eagles. Don't touch that dial because there may be hope. The prime percentages have shifted. They have shifted. It's now a 97% chance of victory for the Jaguars instead of 99. I just wish I would have saw that when it was 19 to 7. This, it would have felt a lot better because it's still too. Two score game on. Why is he kicking off? Onside kick it. It's the Super Bowl. Yeah, I mean, you got to go for an onside kick at this point. At the very least, just sell out and he'll score and get a field goal, which he's probably going to do anyways as he marches up the field. 97% chance. I have seen miracles happen. I would like to see it. I think. Could you that imagine Woods, if there's like a fumble? Yeah, on this it would. Play? What a way to close out a cycle would be Woods coming back, <laughs> like twenty-one point comeback or whatever it is. Yeah, it would be special, for sure. Unfortunately, KP is just too poised. He's not going to allow that. He's going to hand it off. Oh, geez, look at that hole. I just don't know if we're oh going to see gosh. the. I just don't know if we're going to see it. Q. Yeah, I don't think so. He needs to. Did he turn aggressive on for like tackling and strip ball all that? He needs to do something. I don't know. Matt said he just started watching Dealer No Deal reruns. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> That's actually funny. What do you, I like old Howie. He's a little weirdo germaphobe. He I think he wears the same thing that Spooky wore like three years ago. Anyway, um, gun you trips. Could this be a pass? There's no way, right? Uh. It's a pass. I'm going to say it is. No, really? Yep. Oh, man. He's flipping plays or oh, going geez. through a different. I'm way. getting dizzy. Cerebral. Yeah, this guy's I'm cerebral. I'm very dizzy right now. He has Omaha. Oh, my goodness. A, oh, yeah, faked an injury. Oh, wait. Never mind. It's the Jaguars. That stops the clock, though. I shouldn't make predictions. I didn't think KP was going to do it. I don't even remember what I put in the prop bets. Uh, I think I predicted KP victory in the prop bet, but I think that's it. Yeah, Let's I'm going to get close to the, to the score, 27-17. I think I did this. I think I did 31-17. to 17. Um, Don't touch that dial. We do have post-game interviews. Hand off. We could see something interesting. It's a 12-point game. Watch halfback angle with a skinny post. Single back. Opposite side. Oh, okay, never mind. Can't be that play. (laughs) We are two minutes left in the cycle. It's crazy. I feel like this one's went by pretty fast. Uh, The game or the cycle? The cycle. This game's drug on. This game did drag on, especially the second half. 
Um, it's hard when it's the, the blowout. I think the the end of the cycle crept up really fast, yeah. and then it and then it kind of felt longer. But yeah, the end of it, we went to July to August or June to August really fast. Yeah, just in, in life, it feels like life went by fast from June to August. It's good, yeah, it very perceptive. Hand off, big hole, closes quickly. Woods is gonna, he's gonna use his timeout. Yeah, he has no choice. Here we go. So here's where the real fun begins. We could see a miracle. If that happens, yes. what would you do? Would you be, would this be the greatest game ever played in SML history? For the player, play, for the player who achieves it, yeah, I think that because you're saying it's Woods, he'd, it'd be up there. It's in the discussion. I wasn't here for some of those great games that uh, bring the SML Hall still to this day. Yeah. Unfortunately, I was on the losing end of one of them. That's the only one I ever hear about. The Memorial Day Miracle. Hated that game. Is Almost that the one where the ball like bounced, bounced off, off the guy's, guy's knee and into yeah, another guy's like 50, and, and, it, and it went like 30 yards downfield. I have never remember. almost retired because of a game, but that was it. Look at his pressure out the middle. KP does that so well, but Woods seen it. Now what's he going to do? Is he going to go no huddle here? He is. Yeah, you have to. Go four verts. Just grip it and rip it, buddy. Just snap it. Just snap it. Here we go. Just take a shot. Take a shot. Oh, he's hit. Oh, God. Don't take that shot. Intercepted. It's picked off. It's picked off. And That's I golden. think... Uh, will we see timeouts? No. Woods is a class act. He's ready to get on the post call and... Uh, go home. And give his congrats to KP. Yeah, it was a fun game. It was a hard fought battle. I think KP just, he was more, he, he had a really strong playoff run. He beat you. He beat yep. Stavo. He beat me. That's probably the toughest. Oh, Woods <laughs> takes a timeout here. He's not ready to go down without a fight. I don't blame yeah, him. Yeah, that's interesting. Interesting. Um, yeah, I think it, if you were to look at it in that aspect, I would say that uh, KP was definitely more seasoned, definitely more war tested or battle tested, I feel like. Um, yeah, the NFC is great. Obviously, don't get me wrong. I think that going through the gauntlet KP ran through and over what Woods went through yeah. is a little bit harder. Um, KP went through the gauntlet people, for sure. Yeah, Stavo, I mean, Stavo's lost like three games in two years or two yeah. games in two years. So, I mean, he's yeah. it's not an easy defeat. And that KP ran through him. Yeah, he did. KP ran through me, and then he beat you, obviously. Yeah, close game. Very close game. Emotional yeah. game. There's still yeah, Woods I'd... has a chance for a miracle. Um, no. I mean, there's prime percentage to say a 99.99% a .99 chance of victory for the Jaguars at this point. All the analytics point towards KP being the 60, season 65 champion. But there's still 30 seconds left in this game. Which is going to try to punt return, return touchdown would be nice. Punt return touchdown onside kick and a hail mary. All right, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. didn't get the punt return. You just got to throw it sixty yards downfield three times. That's all. Onside kick recoveries are possible. Happened versus me. Yeah, it happens. It never happens for me, but it happens against me. <coughs> me neither. Again, guys, stay tuned. Don't touch that dial. We will have post-game interviews immediately after. KP taking timeouts now. This feels like an NFL game where they're just trying to get every bit of ad dollar they can by using TV timeouts. Yeah, that's crazy. This is just two guys just leaving it out on the field. They know it's the last game. <laughs> they know it's the last game of the cycle. Woods throws quick out route here. Getting upfield. Oh! Gosh, he cut that one close to staying in bounds. <laughs> the question is, everybody's asking, what does KP sound like? Uh, to be honest, I kind of expected a QB stud. Kind of expected how like QB a light stud pitched, sound like. like kind of. Yeah, yeah, kind of a light, friendly pitched, toned. Deathwish asked, Prime, have you ever owned a TV with a dial? No. Well, actually. No, you have not. I don't think I have. Have you? No. 
No, I have not either. I remember being at my grandma's house. Yeah, my, me did. too. That's what I was thinking I of. I remember that. Are, are those one of those big ones where they're like kind of like really heavy and built in and like uh, like they're almost like no, they have a little. They have like a little, almost how you turn up the volume in a car. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Um, they have that to switch the channels and whatnot on the front of the TV. Yeah. The side. No, I've never owned one. I had it when I was a kid. I had one of those Lightning McQueen cars TVs though. I got a question for DW. Have you ever owned the phones that you spin? You have to spin the circle to get to the number, and then you spin it again. The hand, the landline ah. phone. You plug in. You have to spin them. You get to the number, and then you spin it again. I wonder I remember if, that at my grand. Remember that at my parents' house too. You ever use a payphone? Uh, no, I have not. I used think one. I have. But. Uh, Back to throw. Hold on. This could be the last play of the Super Bowl. He throws. It's a drag route. One play left in the season 65 QP. Prop bet. Is it a touchdown? Incompletion? What's the result? Incompletion. He says incompletion. I'm going to say, I'm going to say it. Interception. How will season 65 end? <laughs> How will the, the clock hit zero? Woods back to throw. One play. Super Bowl on the line. <laughs> throws. It jokes and mokes. Oh. And he scores. Touchdown, Eagles. The clock hits zero. And they got another play. He's going to go for two. Barring a penalty, could we see an unnecessary roughness or something to keep this game going? Oh, man. Why not? What a play. This, this game is eight, not he over. Been in the game. Number eight should have been in the game all, all game long. Here we go. Will we see a flag, like a face mask or something? Back to throws, Allen. Pressure up the middle. Oh, he gets oh it, but God. it's over. <laughs> it's over. It was instant pressure and nano blitz again. But the Jaguars are season 65 champions. KP has done it. 26-22. Woods falls to KP. What a season. What an effort. What a game. What a cycle by King Pick 6. Stay tuned. Don't touch that dial. Oh, yeah, we gotta go join the other. We're gonna go join the other call. So we'll be there shortly. All right, I'm adding them to the call right now. All right. Looks like Woods is in here. We have Woods, Woods. in the call. Woods, how are you doing? Oh shoot, I can't hear you. Hold on. He's, he's get, getting his mic fixed. Um, let us know when you can hear us, Woods. All right. Woods is, hear me? Yep, yep, we can hear you. Woods, real quick. Um, good season. Great cycle. You, you you fought to the end, got a touchdown late. How, what do you feel went wrong uh, in that game? I, I, uh, sorry, my volume was off. <laughs> completely out of rhythm. Uh, play calling uh, wise, play. just didn't have didn't have anything mentally. Either. I mean, I have a lot of credit to KP and uh, just myself. I, I was a little bit disappointed I came out as flat as I did, but had a little momentum when it was seven to six. But uh, that's off to KP, man. That was, that was a good game. A lot of a lot of plays I thought my guy should have jumped and didn't, and that kind of demoralized me. And that. Credit to him for that. I have one more question for you, then then uh, QP, and then we'll get to KP, who's in the chat, um, the reigning champion. Um, Woods, is there anything that KP did that surprised you, or was it just just kind of how the game went? Uh, I can't really say he did. I thought I I was prepared for some of those wheel routes. And some of those routes that went to the outside, but uh, I don't know. I I know one play I call that cover two, and Sydney Brinkley should have been there for that pick on the wheel. But I think they hit uh, defense sticks, and that stopped them. Mm -hmm. So I think I was prepared. Is just he he played better. He was he was the better guy today. Q, do you have any questions for Woods? Uh, yeah, just first. Congrats on a really, really, really impressive cycle. I think, in my opinion, this is probably your best cycle you've ever had since you've been in the yeah. SML. Um, yeah, it is. It is. <laughs> I would I would like to see you build off of that, of course, going into next cycle. But about this game, 
Did you wish that who's number eight on your team? That running back at the end. Do you wish that he would have played a little bit more? He looked like um. He, that's uh, I forgot Henry's first name. But his last name is Henry. Well, he's explosive, and uh, yeah, he looked like a guy that should have touched the ball a little bit more in that game. This was one of those games where he was. He just had it, and I guess I'd recognize it a bit too late. Mm-hmm. Probably, should, and I usually run him a couple of times, but I, I, I just thought I had to get the horse that got us here more touches. And now that I'm looking at the stats; he only had ten damn carries, but that's also a credit to QP as well. I'm KP, Jesus, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But and yeah, uh, yeah, I, I probably should have gotten him a few more players. I, I got him just primarily for a pass catcher. If, and that goes back to what I said at the beginning. I just, I just felt out of sync play calling wise, and that's, that's a credit to, to KP. Yeah, and then I just have one last thing. Uh, do you have anything to say going into the next cycle? Is this um, the end? No, no, it, <laughs> it's not. Um, like I said before, when I, when I picked the Jaguars in team selection. Then you know I got two cycles left. That cycle that I picked them and the cycle after that. So whenever you see me pick the Jags, and who knows, and maybe this this uh, <laughs> cover Jeff may not. But wow. uh, I, I at least got two more cycles in me, I think. Let's go. Let's get to now. Let's go. Woods, congrats on a great cycle, a great season, honorable and defeat, honorable and victory. We respect you and we appreciate you, uh, a, a very valued member in our league. Yeah, man, there's, there's no need for me not to come in here. Yeah, I'm disappointed, but, I mean, KP played well, and I, if he's in here and listening, congrats, KP. And I made three Super Bowls. I uh, mean, people can say they've made that in their entire SML career, so I don't want to hear the shit in that. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. one, guys. <laughs> Congrats to KP again, man. I, I'm going to go back and listen to it, but I'm sure you, uh, you guys had a great call on the game, too. Yeah. Uh, no, it was, it was a fun game to watch. Uh, KP, uh, you are SML Season 65 champion. How does it feel, sir? Feels good. Feels good. Didn't think we'd be here. Yeah, it was, it was, a, it was a fun game to watch. Obviously, it seemed like you were you were keyed in on, on what Woods was doing. Um, you played you just played your brand of offense, your brand of defense. What did you what were you what was the game plan going to this game? Was there anything Woods did that surprised you? It just seemed like you were just kind of ready for it all. So uh, the game plan going in was don't turn the ball over. I played the whole game with conservative carry on, uh, which was especially frightening because I didn't get a chance to turn it on on that first punt which uh, I fumbled. Luckily, we got that back. Yeah. Um, but it was try to run the ball, double team, inside stuff. Who knows what's going to happen once I get inside the uh, inside the five because we also had a goal line stuff. So I was pretty hesitant. Passing because his corners are great. Had a good defense. Just wanted to limit the turnovers. I kept settling for field goals and was getting a little nervous. Yeah, I was thinking about that. You had, you had a kick. I think you scored nine points or something, or Woods got a touchdown to go up seven to six, and I thought, oh, maybe we got something. And, and then I think you you had a drive right before halftime, and then you I think you ended up getting a two-for-one potentially. At what point did you feel like, okay, like I'm in control of this game, and, and I've got this? It was uh, – I think it was the third quarter. It was third down in the, uh, the red zone, and I called that bench pivot play. Yep. that I scored the touchdown against you in. Yep. And so uh, I looked to see where his user was after to see if he'd be able to get over to the tight end. And he wasn't near him, but there was a guy there. And so I was like, oh, shit. And so I had a – no, I'm sorry. Uh, the guy on the, the uh, like, quick out, which I hardly ever make it to that progression or that, uh, that read, and somehow got it in there, scored the touchdown, and then the next drive I got the uh, – the lurk on the play action pass and then I was like okay I feel good well that was that was that drive was big uh QP do you have any questions for KP I uh, just want to say congrats uh obviously you had a great cycle uh but a really great final season um you know not a lot of people picked you after uh, until after a few wins but what I would like to say 
was the AFC a little bit harder than you expected in the Super Bowl? And secondly, uh, was Prime is and secondly was Prime was your game with Prime uh, the hardest game? Why did he do that? What? <laughs> what, what are you talking about? Uh, it's hard to compare because I've only played Woods twice this cycle, and I didn't feel like there there was less of like a chess match. Like every time I play Prime, it's like, okay, what has he adjusted? What am I going to do to kind of counter that? And it's just back and forth, back and forth. And I kind of feel the same. Like you and I have played a few times, and oh, whereas this, it was kind of go in with a conservative game plan and see what he does and then try to adjust to it. And so it was a little easy. I don't want to say easier because it was obviously I struggled very early in that game uh, getting touchdowns, but it's different. It's hard to compare. It is. Now, um, you know, we, we obviously, <laughs> I don't know if Wood realized he's back in the call or not. Maybe he did, <laughs> but, but uh, you know, I guess my final question is, Great playoff run. You beat you beat uh you beat KP or excuse me, you beat QP, you beat Stavo, you, you come back against me in, in, in a great game, you beat Woods, you're a champion. What's next for you? Do you is this the end? Are you doing John Elway? Are you coming back next cycle? I've heard before you're more of a you're not really a summer guy. That was the big thing on KP is he doesn't play in the summer. He played till August, a week before Madden twenty five. What's your what's your goals next cycle if there are goals? Uh, I'm going to go in with, I'm going to do my best. Uh, I got a baby coming in the beginning of, beginning of October, so not really sure how that's going to affect my gameplay. My wife has told me that I'm not allowed to, uh, to quit. I got to mm-hmm. still have at least one hobby, so. Yeah, that's awesome. That's good. Oh, I'm able to play. You're going to keep stick it out. I like it, man. Uh, and I enjoyed, uh, I just want to say, it, 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 I did not like losing to you, but I enjoyed wa- I enjoyed watching your game because I feel like you don't do anything that's just corny. It's just cerebral. It's you're just it's an actual chess match. And I, there's only a few players where I feel like it's like mentally I, I, like it, it's a real chess match. And, and you're one of those guys who stretch me mentally in Madden. And when I watch you play, I can tell you're thinking about every single play and every single detail. And, and I kind of appreciate that style of play. It's not always the flashiest, but I feel that style translates from Madden to Madden and translates in the playoffs, which is why you won the Super Bowl today. I appreciate that. Uh, Q, any final questions? No, just congrats uh, and really well done. Thank you, thank you. Look forward to uh, hearing the call. Guys, that was KP, Season 65 champion, the cycle closer, KP is an SML champion. KP, DM me your address if you can so I can get a Simbari trophy heading your way. Guys, this is SML for the final game of the cycle. See you guys in like a couple weeks. See you around.